Another story that we are following, if you've been driving on the Howard Franklin Bridge, you may have noticed a disturbing trend. Dead cats on the side of the road. We're told six of them since June. And today, another incident involving another cat. Our Jake Peterson is live along Howard Franklin Bridge tonight. And Jake, do troopers know how the cats are ending up on the bridge? No, they really don't know why or how right now, and that's what they're investigating. Possibly someone is throwing them out of the car window. Now, most of them end up dead right on the side of the road. Earlier today, a motorist was driving right over the bridge like we're doing right now. I want to show you her view. She was driving right before the hump, and she noticed a white ball of fur flying right towards her. They say cats have nine lives, but this little one is only left with eight after what happened Sunday morning. I don't know how the cat survived. Claudette Zoll says she's driving over the Howard Franklin Bridge when all of a sudden... Out of the corner of my eye, I see something fall out of this person's vehicle. I'm not sure what I thought I saw, but it, it appeared to be a cat. She stops and runs over to it. Well, I went to go pick the cat up, and the cat got scared and ran. Right into her wheel well. You could see just kind of like little eyes looking at you, and I thought, oh my gosh, how am I going to get that cat? FHP and FDOT block traffic, take her wheel off, and save the kitten, who seems to be in good health. She's got a little mark on her face right there for when she had probably hit the pavement. The family is keeping the cat. They haven't decided on a name, but one possible name stands out. I thought about calling it Miracle because... Um, Miracle is it's a miracle it's alive after just watching so many cars go by I can't imagine how it survived and now Claudette is just hoping other cats don't end up in the same spot as miracle especially if this wasn't an accident if this is in some reoccurring incident that is happening on the Howard Franklin it's super important to just catch the person who's doing it Again, FHP is still investigating why and how this is happening to those cats. Claudette says everything happened so fast, she didn't get a good look at the driver. If you see a cat on the side of the road here at the Howard Franklin, call FHP. Reporting along the Howard Franklin, I'm Jake Peterson, ABC Action News.